Refugees, adventurers, no one in years, and suddenly we're overwhelmed. Well met, and thank you for beating back those goblins. Most brave of you. Is there anything you need? Act fast if you do. The ritual will be complete before too long. Um, are you really locking down the grove? I know it's drastic, but more monsters seem to terrorize this region every day. Uh, what about the people here? We druids will be safe. As for those that took refuge here, well... May Sylvanas guard them as they continue their travels. Um... You just said the region's overrun by monsters, they won't survive by themselves? Um... Yeah. As I said, it's a drastic measure. But the survival of the grove is paramount. There just aren't enough supplies to support everyone. Uh, what are you selling? Just some bits and bobs I no longer need. Okay, so we can also sell stuff um, that we don't need. Do uh, the weapons get worn down over time? Or, is, or do they just stay? I think... I don't see anything that says that they're uh, getting broken. So let's... Let's sell one of the scimitars. Let's sell some leftover daggers. You know, just... We don't need to carry, like... Multiples of everything. I'm gonna keep the goblin scimitar and the regular scimitar. I'm gonna keep one bow, one great club, one of the hand axes. Please. Uh, leave them behind. Some of the you short bows. There we go. Um, great club can stay. Right. Those are different bows. Okay. Uh, one short sword. We have, we have enough short swords. I also have one equipped. So let's put that here. Um, oh, this is just a better torch than this one. Uh, I'm gonna get rid of this torch. And... Oh, leather armor, we can get rid of some of that. We have one on, so we don't need that one either. And one of the simple robes. This is about your precious borders gate. I care um, you can have the plate, sure, go ahead. No, Take that, the glass chalice, you can have that as well. Take, that back. Right Take the cup. Take all the stuff I don't need. Um, bottles, sure. Some some tear. Um, the quill, I don't know if we need that for anything. Uh, there's a mug. You can have a quill as well. Milk can. Sure, that seems fine. Do I want anything from here? Padded armor. Okay, that's better than our um, armor, but it's expensive. It's expensive. Um, hide armor. We that's even, even better people. than this one. That doesn't matter. Of course it does. You would choose uh, AC bonus from dexterity limited to plus that's two. Not, not proficient with medium Can armor. Okay. Shooting? I'm going to keep that in mind. That is light armor. Um... That is heavy armor, I don't really need that uh, at the moment. That's medium armor, that's uh, medium armor. I only work with uh, light armor, so I'm gonna... Do I want that? Is that so much better? Uh, that's 11, that's 12. What else could I get? A leather helmet. Uh, what do we have there? Arrow of acid. Arrow of lightning, arrow of ice, arrow of fire. Okay. That sounds interesting. Um, I don't really want a shovel. Calm down. Um, Please. A supply pack for 88. Scroll of dark vision, kill. darkness. Spe scroll to speak with dead. Hmm. Let's see. Do I just take the uh, padded armor? Ah, okay, so you want... Oh, we can put gold in here. Okay, we can make that a bit more exact. Um, let's keep that. 
make it a bit more precise. Don't really want the plates, the cups and all that. If we take that off, we're one gold under. This is about your precious borders gate. I care about our lives. Our future. Is that okay? No. It's been refused, okay. Stupid apprenticeship. Take that back. Fine. Do we have anything for like one gold, this? Take that. There we go. Uh, that is enough of that. Sylvanas, guide your path. Same to you. Okay, let's take a look at the inventory and equip the new armor. There we go. Uh, and let's move on. All right, who else is here? There's a plaque. Can we read that? This grove is kept by Sylvanas' faithful. Matter. Of course it does! You would choose strangers over us! What are you Pearls. arguing about? We can't just leave! They're kin! I'll not gamble our lives, our futures, on people who are as good as dead! We must leave for Baldur's Gate at once! Can we all just take a moment, please? What's the point in blades and spells if we don't bloody use them? We should stay! These people aren't fighters! We can help! Or yell louder. That's fine too. Uh, say nothing. Uh, get out while you can. The goblins will be back. You should all stay. A single blade could make a difference. Let's go for the persuasion then. We need a 10. We have a plus 3. Oh boy. That's not good. That is not good. Mm. No. This place is a death trap. Let us leave. Immediately! Or would you deny your brother here his chance at fortune in Baldur's Gate? What fortune? There's coin in it if you stay. Uh, that's a low blow. Um, what fortune? You know, that money could go towards a spiffy new outfit for your apprenticeship. Sergen. Fine. Give it here. If we survive, it'll make for a good story, I suppose. Thank you, Roland. And thank you, friend. Okay. Let's move along, see who I else wants to talk. I met the rogue and reeking of this place. Toron? Never get the smell. This place is a bloody death trap, not a sanctuary. You should clear off while you can. I'll keep it in mind. There's a hungry ox there. At least make a run for it. Children, look who's here again. The Blade of Frontiers. What a thrill for the children. <laughs> They're tough kids. Smart too. The future's in good hands. Will, do you have anything to say? Go on. Give me a best shot. Not bad. Again. I can't do it. I'm not like you. Umi, I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. Um, hey there, can I have a word? This whelp is hopeless, you're wasting your time. That's, that's not good to say. Um, it's good advice, child. Uh, you do well to listen. Um, I don't really want to talk down to other well, people like that. The blade of frontiers at your... Sh the man's smile bends downward. And his thoughts become yours. You are the blade of frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe hell. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You are on the ship. Yes, and we both carry parasites. Uh, another escapee. Thank the gods. I need all the friends I can get. Um, 
who was that woman the one in your thoughts that's a bit intrusive isn't it um peering further into the mind is also not really the nice thing to do i think um another skp thank the gods better friends than the ones hitching a ride in our skulls at least i'm sure you know the stories doomed to shed our skin and become a lithid they say there's no coming back but we haven't sprouted any tentacles not yet anyway could just be good luck i'm not so your minds collide once more will chases the fiend ignited with rancor she is an infernal war devil a threat to the living evil incarnate shit you saw her advocatus diaboli the devil's advocate um who is she uh hunting in the hells dangerous territory um cavorting with devils i see you should consider better company i'm just gonna ask her name is karlak an arch devil soldier i swore on my good eye to kill i tracked her through the hells to the mind flayer ship but the damned elithids infected me before i could end her she's out there now preying on the innocent i don't kill her she'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses let's join forces um I'll help you cast this devil back into the hells. I'm looking to cure this infection. I suggest we partner up. Good luck with your devil problem. Um, I'm looking for a cure. Uh, I'm looking to cure this infection. Just so you know, my first duty is Karlak. I'm oath bound to go after her. But I won't deny this infection is bothersome. I accept your invitation. Very good. You'll need to make room if you want to partner up, though. Still, when the time comes, call for the blade. I won't be long to answer. Um, go to my camp and wait for me. Yeah, sure. A splendid plan. We'll talk more there. Okay, so um, we could uh, make camp and see about uh, see you, you know, who we could trade out, who would be best to trade out. Let's go to camp. Let's take a look at that. Um, so we have a... I'm a rogue. There's a cleric. That's another rogue. Astarion is another rogue. Gale is a wizard. So if we... Um, there's Will. What are you, Will? What exactly are you? <clears throat> the Blade of Frontiers at your calling. Uh, how does the Blade of Frontiers end up uh, chasing a devil in the hells? Karlak's fires raged in Baldur's Gate before she escaped to Avernus, as my source told it, and she was planning to return. One of the arch devils, Ariel's own. Chaos incarnate, a devil with pure fire for a heart. I made my way to Avernus to stop her. She fled from my reach, even climbed aboard the Mind Flayer ship as it screeched through the hells. I followed in close pursuit. I can't bear to imagine the lives Karlak might be taking, the damage she might be doing. Um, who is the source of yours? A powerful friend with a keen interest in privacy. I'm sworn to say no more. All right, let's move on to other matters. All right. What else is on your mind? Um, I've noticed your stone eye. Did you lose it in battle? A most vicious one, in fact. It's made from pure bloodstone, carved from the Galena Mountains just north of the Moon Sea. A reminder that sometimes blood must be shed and sacrifices must be made. Ah, but that story is reserved for lifetime friends and calmer days. Uh, I'd like to talk about something By else. All means. What else is on your mind? Tell me, Will, how did you come to be the Blade of Frontiers? My father once said, One does not pursue a champion's life. One merely answers its call. So it was for me. I was hunting near the Cloakwood when I heard it. 
A child crying out from a lone farmstead. I found him in the fields flanked by goblins. His mother's corpse bled into the soil next to him. I don't remember much of the battle, but I remember drying the boy's tears after. Um, what act could be finer than saving a life? Uh, you must have felt proud. Um, and he named you the Blade of Frontiers? Uh, whatever became of the boy, I wonder? Goblins? Pitiful vermin? Easy to kill? Hardly worth getting worked up about. Nah, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna go for options like that. I, I, I don't like the vibes they give off. Um, and he named you the Blade of Frontiers? No. But he named me friend. And that meant the world. But what of the others? The children never saved. The cries never heard. In the boy's tears, I finally saw the suffering wrought by the villains of the wild. The frontiers demanded a blade. And so I heeded. Um, and before that, um, how great could you be? I've never heard of you. That, I'm, not I'm not gonna go down those routes. Uh, and before that? Baldur's Gate, born and raised. The only son of a single father. He wanted one life for me. I chose another. We haven't spoken since I left the city. A classic drama. <laughs> a staunch father and his rebellious son. Better heard from the bard's lips than mine. Um, I don't suppose you've come across an expert healer in your travels? <laughs> I've come to know a fair few village clerics. But none with the skill to pull these worms from our heads. From what I understand, there's a healer called Nettie in the grove. Perhaps she's got the talent. We should pay her a visit. I agree. Uh, I'd like you to join me. Make some room and I'm all Right, yours. we have to uh, get rid of someone first. Can we take a look at uh, the party view? Uh, can we take a look at... Um, At will? Or do we have to add him to the party first? Um, Alright, let's... As sorry as I'm going to feel... Like, as bad as I'm going to feel, feel about it, I'm going to get rid of um, Astarion. Because, you know, he's, he's a rogue. So, we're traveling with the famed Blade of Frontiers. I feel safer already. Well, we are traveling with the face, uh, with the blade of frontiers. You're not. Oh, darling, I'm hurt. I thought we had something special. Um, please just stay here. I guess I'll spend my evenings lounging here while you do all the hard work. It sounds awful. Yeah, I'm sure you're heartbroken. Now let's add Will to the party. Well met. I'd like you to join me. That's the spirit. What are you then? A warlock. Okay. Here Let's take a look are. at Will and level him up. So that's four different um, classes, I suppose. That's probably going to be helpful. I don't know if there's like classes that are like worse at fighting specific things. I. Again, I'm not an expert on this. This is my first time ever playing a game like like a ball escape game and uh, all that stuff. Um, so I don't know, but it seems like a reasonable thing to have, right? Warlock spell slot gained. Let's gain a spell then. Uh, burning hands. Each flammable target is hit with three to eighteen fire damage. On save, target still take. Oh, on target still take half damage on saves. Okay. Charm a person, um, command, uh, expeditious retreat, uh, gain dash immediately and as a bonus action on each of your turns until this spell ends, uh, hellish rebuke, react to your next attacker with flames that deal 2 to 20 fire damage, on save target still takes half damage, that seems good to have, a hex, um, 1 to 6 necrotic damage make your attacks deal an additional one to six necrotic damage uh, to the target and give it disadvantage on an ability of your choosing okay so that's 
so that adds it to our attacks to our other attacks that seems good to have protection from evil and good um witch bolt one to twelve damage lightning damage um uh, link yourself to a target with a bolt of lightning deal an additional one to twelve lightning damage each turn by activating it okay that seems good um I might go for the Hellish Rebuke. Or should I go with the... Uh, where was it? Or should I go with the Hex? Um, now, you know what? I'll, I'll go with the Rebuke. There we go. Eldritch Invocations. Uh, in your study of occult lore, you have unearthed Eldritch uh, Invocations. Fragments of forbidden knowledge that imbue you with an abiding magical prowess. Agonizing Blast. Um, when you cast Eldritch Blast, add your Charisma modifier to the damage it deals. Okay. Armor of Shadows. When you cast Mage Armor on yourself at, uh, at will without... Oh, you can cast Mage Armor at yourself at will without expending a spell slot. Seems good as well. Beast speech, you can cast speak with animals at will without expending a spell slot. Beguiling influence, you invoke your uh, patron's bewitching charm. You gain proficiency in deception and persuasion. Devil sight, you can see normally in darkness, both magical and non-magical, to a distance of 24 meters. Fiendish vigor, you can cast false life on yourself at will. As a level 1 spell without expending a spell slot, uh, False Life grant, uh, grants you 7 temporary hit points. Um, Mask of Many Faces, uh, you can cast Disguise Self at will, okay. Uh, one with the Shadows, you learn how to cast One with the Shadows. It's a passive feature, I don't really know what it does. Uh, Repelling Blast. When you hit a creature with Eldritch Blast, you can uh, push the creature up to 4.5 meters away. Uh, Thief of Five Fades. Once per long rest, you can cast Bane using a Warlock spell slot. Bane targets up to three creatures. They receive a 1d4 penalty to attack rolls and saving throws. Um, I don't know what my Charisma modifier is like that's just the uh oh the plus three is that the modifier seems decent then i'll take that and um i mean we could make this uh, uh this blast particularly good just knock him away and do extra damage seems fine Um, the amount of spells you can have fixed in your mind is limited. As you level up, you may wish to replace old spells with new ones. Choose a spell uh, you know and replace it with another. Um, armor of Agathis and the Arms of Hadar. I, what, what else uh, can we do here? Ah, okay. So, um, Witch Bolt, Charm Person, Command, Expeditious Retreat, Hex, Protection from Evil and Good. Um, which one do we have? Uh, do we want to have? Um, maybe we want to add Hex. And... Hmm... Gain 5 temporary hit points and deal 5 cold damage to any creature that hits you with a melee attack. Or the Arms of Hadar, which is an attack um, with uh, 2 to 12. Doesn't. Hmm. I might remove the armor of Agathis for now. And we get the hex to make. Um, Make attacks, deal additional damage. Sure, that seems fine to me. Let's accept that. Okay. Can I... Oh. No time I'm gonna to play rest. myself again. 
Can I, like, go to the campfire and, like, heal myself or something? No, I don't want to end the day. Um, short rest. Yeah. Oh, that took the edge off. There we go. That seems good. And let's leave the camp. And move on. Alright, there we are. Shadowheart, Gale, and people that are training right now. Wait, where, where are we again? Right. There we are. Let's try to find the um, potential healer. That would be good to uh, to see. I mean, I I highly doubt that we're gonna get that thing removed now. Soru, uh, Aramis. I need a quick word. I, I don't know. Do they have anything to How talk about? How long got before the goblins come? Okay, nothing uh, of note. Just a little bit of background dialogue, I guess. Octa, who are you? I die if I met you. Saw you fighting those slimy bastards. Fancy a bowl? Best to fill your belly now while we still can. Um, I'll take it. Look, it ain't much, but it might make all the difference. The only way we'll make it to Baldur's Gate is to run and run hard. If a knoll catches your scent, you'll need every bit of strength. Trust me. Oh, I believe you. I believe you on that one. Uh, thank you for the gruel. For some salt. Um, anything else in here? I'm not going to steal anything. That's not what I'm going for. Hope the goblins aren't smart enough to poison their blades. All right. If it ain't the fearless goblin slayer, you sure you want to be seen with me? I ain't exactly popular with this lot. Uh, all you did was stand up for your crew. Uh, I respect that. You could try to be a little friendlier. Uh, I mean, you could try to be a little friendlier, that's true. Thanks, Mum. Now please do feck off. Feck off yourself. I saved your skin back at the gates. Charming, I can see why the locals like you so much. Them devils ain't local. They're refugees. Fella who runs this place offered him shelter. Uh, I should speak with that uh, fellow. Do you know where he is? Aye. His name's Halsin. And if he's still alive, he'll be cursing the day he laid eyes on me. We've got a contract. To track down some relic. And he wanted in on the job. Eyes lit up when he heard about it. Didn't work out, though. Goblins got him when we were turning tail. He's either digging latrines or boiling in a cook pot by now. Uh, can I have a look at that contract? Uh, do you think getting rich would be... Uh, did you think getting rich would be easy? You ran uh, away from a few goblins? I, I don't really feel the need to, like, tease the guy about it. Like, sure, he's being a bit of an asshole, but I don't need to be mean in return. Uh, can I have a look at that contract? Job's all yours, if you got a death wish. There's a wizard in Baldur's Gate that'll pay gobloads for a relic supposedly buried round these parts. But gold ain't any use if you're too cold to spend it. That is true. Um, but let me know where to find it, okay? Uh, oh, first of all, any idea what the relic actually is? If I knew that, I wouldn't be back here with half my crew gone. But look, if you're itching to meet Kellenvor, I won't stop you. It's called the Night Song. It's supposed to be hidden under the temple where the goblins jumped us. I'd give you the map and wish you a happy funeral, but my mate Brian kept hold of it like his own todger. Goblins made sure to the fat old chunk. All I've got's the contract. It'll show you where we turn back, if you feel like dying. Thanks. <laughs> Don't thank me. I'll be well on my way to Boulder's Gate when you die. Was a ray of, sh of sunshine that guy is. Um, Can't wait to get back to the gate. Aradin. I'm drinking. Oh, still the You're same guy. Leaving. He's in a. Yeah, I'm leaving. We'll uh, camera angle changed a bit. Ramira. Damn goblins. Um. You should 
Uh, should we wait? Like the sight of blood, do you? <clears throat> Thought you'd have had your fill at the gate. Might be more blood spilled yet. If Zevlor starts in on the lectures again. Um, I'd have done the same. Um, I'd have done the same in your place. Uh, he let you in, didn't he? Uh, it could have been worse. You are to blame. Uh, you put his people in danger. Um. Hmm. Which one do I go with? Um. Uh, I mean, yeah, he he did let them in. Oh, very gracious of you. We expected a soft job, something to test the new lad, maybe, but not a bloody goblin nest. Most would have turned tail at the sight, but oh. not Liam. No, he charged them. The stupid bastard. I'm guessing that didn't end well. No, he. Must have thought we were following. Always the optimist was Liam. Hope they cut him down quick before he saw we were gone. All right. Small mercies. Let's see who else is in this. Uh... Don't you lie to me, boy. I know you.